Hey now, I'm back with another exclusive trading system that has been proven extremely profitable over a series of 100 trades. And be sure to stick around to the end because I am going to show you how you can make this even better. But right now, just crush that subscribe button like you're trying to avoid this. I call this system the ultimate triple, and like most trading systems, it can be adapted to Forex, crypto, options, stocks, indices, or any instrument that has significant volume and market participants. This trading strategy uses three free TradingView indicators. As always, links and settings to all indicators are listed in the description. The first indicator is the standard 200 exponential moving average colored in white. This indicator will confirm overall trend direction. The second free trading view indicator is the very popular ultimate moving average multi time frame version 2 by Chris Moody. We are going to keep all the inputs at default settings. I'm going to change the style to create a single yellow line. This indicator is a custom trading view indicator that uses multiple moving average studies in an attempt to show trend direction. Most people use this study by keeping the buy sell or green and red colors on the chart, but that may not be the most effective way to use it. More on that in a moment. This indicator is going to provide our setup and trigger entries. The third and final indicator is another ultimate moving average. However, on this one, we are going to uncheck use current chart resolution and make the time frame one day. Again, I'm going to remove the red and green color signals and make it one solid orange line. This study will provide additional confirmation of trend direction. Let's go over entry criteria and review some examples. As always, system rules and details are listed in the description below. This chart is Euro versus the US dollar, four hour candles. The rules to enter along on the ultimate triple are, first, price must be above the 200 exponential moving average in white. Second, the four hour ultimate ultimate moving average in yellow must be above the daily ultimate moving average in white. Finally, price must touch or go below the four hour EMA and then close above it. All of that happens on this candle here. That is our trigger candle. We place our stop below the previous swing low and target two to one. And this one hits our two to one target. If you enjoy this content, make sure to click the like button. We have one more long example. Price is above the 200 EMA. The four hour ultimate moving average is above the daily ultimate moving average. Price pulls back into and then closes above the four hour UMA. This is our trigger. We place our stop above the previous swing low and target two to one and this one hits two to one. Now we flip to shorts. This is what I will test for shorts. First, price must be below the 200 exponential moving average in white. Second, the four hour ultimate moving average in yellow must be below the daily ultimate moving average in white. Finally, price must touch or go above the four hour EMA and then close below it. This candle closes below the four hour EMA and is our trigger. We place our stop above the previous swing high and target two to one and this one hits our target. I'm gonna show you one more quick short example. Price is below the 200 EMA. The four hour ultimate moving average is below the daily UMA. Price pulls back into and then closes below the four hour ultimate moving average. This is our trigger. We place our stop above the previous swing high and target two to one. And this one hits our target of two to one. I'm gonna give you some ideas on how we can make the system even better along with a trader's landing score. And now it's time to do what I do. If you enjoy this content, hit the like button. Remember, this is just 100 tests on one instrument. If you are thinking of using the system, please do all the required testing and be sure to let our community know what you discover. This test was on the Euro versus the US dollar four hour candles. It took a quick 20 months to find the 100 setups. We had a winning rate of 54%, which included the most wins in a row of six and the most losses in a row of seven. And I'm going to tell you how we can greatly improve this. The gross gain on account risking 2% per trade was 124% and I'm going to share two ideas on how we can even improve that. You can see that during the first 50% or so of this test, we get a very impulsive move up and then a brief drawdown followed by a lesser impulsive move up. The reason why this happens is this system makes a ton of profit when the market is trending and then when the market is in consolidation, 
this strategy becomes less effective. But I'm going to go over how we can overcome this. What score would you give this strategy? Let me know in the comments below. I give this system a trader's landing score of 7 because there is huge potential to optimize this system, especially with a dynamic take profit system. Before we dive into these ideas, I just want to call out the viewer who inspired me to come up with the ultimate triple. For some reason, YouTube deletes some comments for no apparent reason like this one, and this was a great suggestion. Remember, the enemy of great is good. I have two ideas on how we can improve this system. First, we can use a two-stage take profit strategy. Look at this chart. You can see our profit target just missed and then the trade stops out. Moving our stop to break even after a move in our direction will increase the win rate of the system for sure. For example, when it hits one to one or hits some ATR level, we can then move our stop. Secondly, if you are not as concerned with the win rate and more on growing your account, you can use a dynamic take profit system. Look at this chart here. You can see that this setup hit our target and then took off like a rocket. What if instead of using a fixed risk to reward, we added the SSL hybrid indicator like we tested to great success here. If we exited this trade on the bearish signal of the SSL, our risk to reward would have been an insane 8.2. Check out this playlist for more profitable systems and have a great day if you want to.